Hey, y'all. Hey, I'm sitting here. Hey, I'm looking. Hey, I, I, I got somebody's phone, bro. And this one that popped up on their phone. Bro, let me tell y'all about her. Let me. Bro, she really low key pressed. Mad. Why would you want to come and do She mad because I told her. Bro, you right now is a good not 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 a good time to interview us because of the kids uh dealing with their CPS. Now all of a sudden now she wanna come out and say all this. Hello. Hello, thank you all for tuning in. And watch hey Shemika. Watch how many times she mentioned hey the, the platform a business, heavy better entertainment. She was trying to get clout. Now all of a sudden these kids going through CPS and I told her right now and ask how many interviewers I did told them right now not a good time to interview us because the kids going through something right now. And she won't count that bad. She gotta try to do it by this night. If you felt that type of way, why you trying to still come do questions in relationship uh answers with me and Jazz? After I called you. After I called you, you told like you just said, you told Jazz you ain't healed that, but they walked me out physically. But why you ain't tell Jazz that time? Yeah, he was flirting with people too. Girl, you chasing for clout. I, you mad because I told you right now ain't a good time to be interviewers because these kids going through this CPS stuff. Now you sitting up on here trying to post for clout. But you was a real woman. You you wouldn't even be doing that to Jazz, but trying to tell you Jazz a monster. You trying to say Jazz a monster. Watch out for the time she interview with this. this so, I just want to let y'all know. Yes, I do know NFL League. Do I know them personally where I know their family business? No. Do I know Jazz? No, I've talked to her a couple of times on the phone. We were supposed to do an interview previous hey. to all this bull crap that's going on in their life right now. Hey, look. Look how she just look at it. You a woman, you talking about bull crap. Bro, these people didn't got they... But we didn't got these kids too. That's not bull crap. And for you to sit there and be talking about an interview, do you understand these kids is with CPS and you mad about them up? Thanks to NFL League. Yeah, I said NFL. NFL League. Thanks to you. And I'm saying it because of the simple fact that girl wouldn't be in all this type of stuff if it wasn't for you. And the only reason why I'm coming to the internet about it because I, I wouldn't even speak on it. But at this point, brother, you look dumb as hell right now. Yeah, that's crazy. And that she, oh, and, and don't she look so pressed? Oh, who is she? Let me take a minute. You see this right here? <laughs> Man, he sees on TikTok all the time. Well, they cracking me up at the day, right? Straight up. I met him that day. Straight up, right? Hey, look. Hey, she, is she smiling in the video? Then I tell you, I call her after the video. The, 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 what she was telling Jazz, y'all ain't seeing why. But so, if you felt that type of way, you respect Jazz the way you respect women as a woman. Why you ain't tell her that day? But why all of a sudden you still trying to do interviews with us after you know all this? If I was just now, you reaching for clout. This is the definition of people trying to get clout, bro. Hey, watch her. Now, watch her. Watch how she mentioned the fact that I tried to manage them. You mad because I wouldn't let you manage us. When, when I was trying to tell you, I ain't let nobody manage us because right now I don't know what's going on, bro. I do not know what's going on with what's going on. I'm not going to just take the first person running up and you should respect that. But now you feel like since you work with me at job that day, I should give you the leeway. Even when I told you the first time about the interview, you just fucked up. Now you want to charge because you've been on TMZ when I knew your ass first. Now all of a sudden you want to talk about, you want to come out with this. Bro, hey, when you say, when you say something, say the real, man. You mad, bro. Watch this. Not knowing that this man was going to start putting dumb Bad shit out on the platform, you know? Like I said, I tried to be a person to come help him do his content. I wasn't even going to charge him, and that's a charge. We charge everybody for content. But I seen that they needed some help. So I'm like, okay, get a, you do a blessing, you get a blessing. So I didn't mind trying to take the time out. But when I seen that every time I tried to go over... Look, you somebody, you want to come help us, but now... 
you were just saying, oh, he was just cheating. He, why would you want to help somebody that you know that's been cheating, bro? You want to talk bad, bro. You making yourself look real bad, bro. You still want to help after this. You knowing you saying you didn't see me do all this. You still want to come interview. Bro, you is mad because I told him you can't interview us right now because the kids is doing this still with CPS. That's only respectable. You being disrespectful going on. Knowing, then you going to say, come on, you out of line, man. Look. To their house after he done already gave me the address. I'm confused on why he gave me the address, too. And every time it was time to go, he kept throwing it out, making up excuses and stuff like that. So in my head, maybe all the facts and allegations about you are true. Is, is, because a real exactly, y'all.